Who'd have thought that NFTs being completely worthless just a few months ago would not have been the worst thing that they could do? The holders of the Bored Ape NFTs, which was one of the most popular collections out there, actually had a party that they were all invited to for holding that prestigious JPEG. And that party actually turned up being severely terrible as a lot of them actually ended up going blind as a lot of them lost their eyesight due to some UV exposure. Here is an article talking about that saying the Bored Ape NFT event leads to at least 15 attendees reporting a severe eye burn. A lot of people saying that their eyes were burning. A lot of people saying they lost their eyesight had to go to the hospital for this all for this luxurious Bored Ape JPEG party in Hong Kong that people get to spend hundreds of thousands of dollars to own these JPEGs. And not only is the value plummeting and going to zero, now you also get to lose your eyesight. Some of the people that talked about this saying right here, woke up in the middle of the night after Ape Fest with so much pain in my eyes that I had to go to the hospital. Doctor told me this was due to UV from the stage lights. So that is the big thing that is supposedly happening. Apparently they're supposed to be black lights or something, but whoever set it up is put UV lights and they actually made, uh, they're super damaging to your eyes. They are not good to be staring at for hours on end. Another person saying to all my friends who suffer, uh, now go get your eyes checked. You've most likely literally got your eyes burnt with UV like I did, which requires medications, eye drops, eye protection, antibiotics, and specialist care. Don't ignore this health hazard. So, Obviously, a lot of people complaining about this. Uh, they say for it's only 15 attendees. I think the number is probably much higher than that. You can see someone right here talking about it, responding, saying in case anyone hasn't seen yet, a bunch of NFT guys went to an NFT convention, I guess it was a party, and were blasted by prolonged UV light and went blind. Now, I don't know if they're fully blind and like never going to be able to see again, which would be absolutely insane. Uh, or if they're like partially blind for like a period of time while they get treatment and stuff and get better. Hopefully nobody goes blind from this. Uh, this is a reaction to people's, uh, well, this is their their tweet they put out, Bored Ape Club. They said, apes, we're aware of the eye-related issues that affected some of the attendees in Ape Fest and have been proactively reaching out to individuals since yesterday trying to find the potential root causes Based on our estimates, we believe that much less than 1% of those attending and working the event had these symptoms. While nearly everyone has indicated their symptoms have improved, we encourage anyone who feels who, who feels them to seek medical attention in this case. And we got a funny response from Zach XPT saying this is what people are seeing, right? They fixed the post for them. But this is the response that they put out. Not anything super special, not insane, doesn't seem... Like they actually really care. It seemed like more a, more of a PR thing. And if we look at how people took it and responded to it, that's exactly how everyone looks. Says they basically think it's coming from a PR team saying for to for guys completely downplay it. Make it look like it's a small number, less than 1%. Make it look like you're actively helping and solving and then try to find the potential root causes even though we know exactly what it was. And in this case, we do know exactly what it was. It was UV lights. The lights were supposed to be a different type of light, I think a black light, and they ended up putting in UV lights. And now everyone is screwed who was at that party because they didn't expect it to be that, wasn't supposed to be that, and prolonged exposure to that type of stuff is not good for you, it's terrible. People were waking up the next day, burned eyes, couldn't see, I couldn't imagine how scary that would be to go to bed one night after a thing you thought was just a normal party and then all of a sudden wake up and you can't see anything and your eyes are burning and now it's all because of this nft not only did this nft project manage to take hundreds of thousands of dollars per jpeg from you and turn it into basically nothing now they're able to also do that and then also take your eyesight make you go blind and just mess up your life even more who would have thought after going completely worthless, that JPEGs would have been able to just ruin your life even more, <laughs> even worse. And who would have been able to guess that this isn't even the first time something like this has happened in this basically same spot. I think it was in Hong Kong as well. This dangerous incident echoes one in 2017 when attendees of a hype beast party reported eye damage. So this, it seems like a, a thing here, right? Hype beast sounds like kind of a weird 
trying to get together people you know, of the same community, just people trying to get together and do something, and it turns out to be a bad thing. This is the same thing, right? Bored apes, these apes, these people are trying to get together, do something fun, and it, it just ends up being even worse than the JPEGs that they bought and potentially life-ruining. Now, hopefully, you know, nothing uh, terrible comes up. Hopefully nobody actually goes completely blind from this. I don't know exactly how this works, how it's going to react if you you basically if you're done right if this happens to you or if there's a chance that the treatment can actually just make it better make it so that you don't actually have to be blind for the rest of your life because that would be insane these nft projects manage to not only take all of your money everyone whose money is in here these are expensive hundred of thousand dollar jpegs that are worth substantially less and in some cases worth zero they not only ruined you financially, now they're going to ruin you physically so that you can't see anymore. Crazy stories, insane. If there's anything more you need to see to just stay away from NFTs and JPEGs because they're not worth it, they're not valuable, and they're only going to ruin your life, this is a great example to show you just that. But again, hopefully nothing you know really bad comes of this. Hopefully no one actually goes blind forever because that would be terrible. But for now... The craziest stories of this NFT series continues to go on. They went to zero and now they're making it so you can't even see your own JPEG that you spent $100,000 on. That's going to do it for this video though. As always, remember to smash the button and subscribe and I'll see you guys in my next.